hey y'all welcome back to another video please remember to like and if you're new here subscribe now brooklyn posted a tiktok and got people in the comment section going wild and so the tiktok had said oh you got a gf but text me i miss you is crazy and people in the comment section wanted to know who she was referring to now someone even had commented sometimes i gotta remind myself this could refer to anyone now she did go live and a lot of people in the comment section were asking about the TikTok. And so she responded. Who said they missed you? <laughs> Y'all are messy. Nobody. Nobody. Who texted you I miss you? Bro, nobody texted me I miss you. It's just the TikTok. But y'all let me hear her views when it comes on to that. Now she posted on threads. Just because you lost me as a friend doesn't mean you gave me as an enemy much love. Now she did also post MF stealing ideas now. But y'all let me hear your views when it comes down to that. Now I do want to move on to this next topic. Now Influencer City posted on their story that cops pulled up at their house again. And this was posted early this morning. Now it also seems that they'll be having a new show after Influencer City posted. It's a show about couples compatibility and friends with benefits. Feature Bay shooting it in two days with 16 influencers that I coupled up. And me and my heart may be a couple on the new show. Now that same day, Nia was on live and she stated that she'll be on the new show. But I do want to hear your opinion on this. How do y'all feel knowing that they are having a new show? And a couple show at that. Now I do want to move on to this next topic. With Benet and Angel. Now Angel was on Instagram Live. And she spoke on what Benet had said on Influencer City episode 4. Now Benet also stated that he showed Terry and Nia. And so Angel stated that Terry didn't tell her anything. Bitches be liking to play the innocent role though. Once again, not saying my nigga is innocent. <laughs> Bitches be liking to play the innocent role. People like to make their self look good. Just, you know. Tell the full story. Tell the full story. Tell everything. It takes two. It takes two. Put two and two together. I'm not gonna... I'll always be straight. Y'all don't have to feel bad for me. Like, y'all don't have to feel bad for me at all. Cause that's where y'all get y'all y'all be getting y'all emotions and y'all feelings attached to my life. Was Nia being messy? That's what shocked me. Nia and Terry, okay. The girl, the that girl had a okay, she don't fuck with me, okay, she had something. But Nia, Nia, we was just keeping it cordial. I I feel like I knew she knew something. Cause it was something that happened on the bus, y'all. I ain't gonna need to talk about it. But I was being cool with Nia the whole time. Like, I never had a problem with Nia, but y'all know her and that girl, like, best friends. So, you know, I expected it. But Terry, I thought me and Terry was cool. Terry ain't tell me shit. But, y'all, I do want to hear your views on this down in the comment section below. No, I'm guessing maybe people were sending Benet what Angel had said. Now, Benet retweeted a tweet that said, Hate a B-word who don't know how to be friend, but know how to be a dummy for an N-word. She also said, pray about it as much as you think about it. But y'all, I do want to hear your views on everything down in the comment section below. Please also leave a like, subscribe, and turn on your post notification bell so that whenever I upload, you are notified.